Putting infinity into here just gives us infinity over infinity to the power of infinity, which isn't very helpful. So what we're going to do first is we will find the limit of the log of this, and then the limit we seek is e to the power of that limit. So let's have a look at the limit as n approaches infinity of the log of 2n plus 1 over 2n minus 3 to the power of 3n, and that equals the limit as n approaches infinity of 3n times the log of 2n plus 1 over 2n minus 3. Now putting this in L'Hopital form, that gives us the limit as n approaches infinity of log of 2n plus 1 minus log of 2n minus 3 over 1 over 3n. And now what we can do is we can differentiate top and bottom using L'Hopital to find this limit. And that gives us the limit as n approaches infinity of 2 over 2n plus 1, that's differentiating that, minus 2 over 2n minus 3, that's differentiating that, and then differentiating this gives us minus 1 over 3n squared. Tidying all of this lot up, that gives us the limit of minus 8 times minus 3n squared all over 4n squared minus 4n minus 3 and if we can get rid of that minus sign there that dividing by n squared top and bottom that gives us the limit as n approaches infinity of 24 over 4 minus 4 over n minus 3 over n squared they go towards 0 which just leaves us with 24 over 4 which is 6 and therefore the limit we seek is e to the power of that which is answer e.